My name is Danny, and I live in Newport Beach for the past 30 years. I also raised three kids on my own. I'm a single parent. My older daughter's name is Leslie, my son is John, and my younger daughter is Christine with a C. In 2013, I had an episode of uh, mild aneurysm. I was rushed to Hoke Emergency Room. When I first diagnosed with the condition, I thought I can manage my condition with diet and exercise. Within a year, you know, I had an aorta dissection and that triggered a stroke on top of it. On August 5th, in the morning, there's a police officer at my front door asking me something about an incident in the neighborhood. And I was trying to answer his question, then I collapsed. He called the um, ambulance and rushed me to the whole emergency. I got a call from my sister that I've always dreaded. And um, she told me that my mom had had a stroke and was going into surgery. I realized now I had to face it and I was the eldest child so I had to help my family get through this. When I first heard about what happened to my mom, I got a text saying my mom was in the hospital in surgery. Um, so me and my older sister, uh, we met up at the airport and flew straight down to Hook Hospital. At about 11.30 p.m. that evening, we sat down with mom's surgeon, Dr. Caffarelli, and he is one of the most amazing people I've ever met in my life. And I felt such confidence in this man. I felt if he couldn't save her, no one could. Now we just had to pray and hope that she made it through the evening. So it was amazing that he has knowledge to do what he has to do to save me. I was holding her hand and speaking to her, and she opened her eyes for the first time. To see her wake up and to nod at us was the biggest relief, I think, during the whole ordeal because we knew, just seeing her responding to us, that she had came back. The nurses on that floor were unbelievable. My mom and I actually, when she was starting to feel better, we talked about it and said how we wanted to bring June and Anita home with us. And uh, they were just amazing. They took such great care of her. They were so helpful with my family and friends. Slowly but surely, I'm back to myself. It's been a long process. She's my best friend, and I had to move down here and be with her for two and a half months during it because I needed to take care of her, and she was my priority. I think it's brought my daughter and my mom very close. She just wanted to be there and kept hugging her and saying she wanted her to feel better. So I think it's made my whole family close with my mom, and we value her, and we're just happy she's here with us. She's a blessing, she's a gift from God. We are so fortunate to have Hulk in our community.